I recently got this one and I want to compare the two. I want to tell you guys what I like and what I don't like about this one and also this one. And so have you ever felt betrayed? Hi guys, welcome back again to my channel. If you're seeing me for the first time, hi, my name is Jennifer. In this channel, we talk about skincare product reviews and beauty tips. Please consider subscribing and turn your bell notification on so that YouTube will notify you whenever I upload a new video. And to you all my returning subscribers, thank you so much for always being here. And if you've been watching me and are yet to subscribe, please let it touch your heart today to support me by subscribing and liking my videos. Please, you all should always like my videos so that YouTube will suggest my video to some other people. Okay, so today I want to compare and also review these two sunscreen i've actually reviewed this particular one in this channel several times so but i recently got this one and i want to compare the two i want to tell you guys what i like and what i don't like about this one and also this one and i will be applying it on my face so that you guys will see for yourselves okay so if it sounds like something you'll be interested in please please continue watching this one is feel sunblock and this one is skin doctor sunscreen okay so this has been my sunscreen for a while now uh, so i got this one recently and i want to compare it now i want you to know something about this one this one contains vitamin a c and e which is you know like i really but this is what draw me into buying it i saw this and i'm like i really need to try this i like moisturizing product maybe because i have a dry skin that's why i always you know look out for products that are moisturizing while giving me what i really wanted from them okay so this one is a good having said that i'm going to follow the two finger rule Always remember to apply on your neck so that your neck will not be different from your body. Okay. Yeah. Sometimes I get so mad, there's no control in me. My thoughts get so bad, I'm like, I might grab a bat. I don't know my wrath, my blood boils over like. Oh God, here goes. I lost all feeling from my head to my toes. You said some shit that I can't let go. So just stay tuned for the rest of the show. So have you ever felt betrayed? Which is how you see things. Realize something needs change. Cause I know you got me up. Let me show you what's up. Cause enough is enough. I'll take a face full of pavement just to make a stand.
so guys can you guys see the moisturizing effect i'm talking about this product is like i wish i knew this one before this one i don't know why i'm thinking like that this one is great this one is great it's been serving me for a while now but to be honest i prefer this i prefer this one i prefer this on the body of the product they said it feels clean and weightless fast absorbing leaves skin soft and protected and which is true like it absorbs real fast and for the fact that it doesn't leave any white cast just look at my face the glowing is actually glowing better than my body because okay come to think of it my face is oh my god can you see it's very very moisture highly moisturizing so it's quite moisturizing it has spf 60 yes spf 60 i wish i, I knew this one before this one honestly i wish i knew this one before this one even though this one is costly because i bought this one i bought this one three thousand around four or five dollars so this one i bought this one i think two thousand yeah two thousand three thousand okay so guys i had to go and wash my face off before applying the um, skin doctor sunscreen okay i have to wash off the previous um sunscreen that i applied so that i'll be able to apply this one so that you guys would see the difference between this and the other one so now i'm not going to blend it if you want to see how i use it if you have any sunscreen that leaves a white cast please watch my previous videos and see how i do it to avoid the white cast but because i want to share the difference between this one and this one i want to use the same method i used in the first one and then apply this one too so that you guys will see what i mean Can you guys see? And it's quite drying. That's another thing I don't like about it. It's drying and it leaves a white card. Like, can you see? Whew. I really don't like that about it. I actually tried so well in blending it. If you didn't blend it well, like this is going to be even better off. So, but I think I tried in blending it in. But then, if you come close to me, you would see that it has a white cast so so my review i would say please go for this this fear this fear ultra high sunblock dry touch spf uv60 with vitamin a c and e is superb it's amazing it's even better than gavia sunblock it's better than gavia sunblock like it's go for this please go for this like i said for the price range this one is three thousand and this one is um two thousand three thousand should be around four to five dollars and this one should be around three to four dollars yep three to four dollars um so i don't know if i'm correct please correct me if i'm if i'm wrong and that's it basically that's it if i'm recommending for anybody i'm gonna recommend this so this i'm gonna give it oh 10 over 10 9 over 10 for this i'm gonna give it 5 over 10 so guys this is gonna be the end of this video if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and share this video to your friends i'll see you guys in my next video before then please stay away from trouble bye